Hello, dear shooters. So we're here in uh, Germany, in Dortmund, at a um, training center. Uh, Alex is going to be helping us today. Uh, hi, Alex. Um, so we'll uh, we'll test two training systems today. We'll test the SCAT and the Trace. We have previously tested them, and uh, um, we also um, offered the, the Trace representatives to come out with us to any major international competition and test it together. However, we, we offered that several times. Um, we were ignored, so uh, we, we had no choice but to come out to a, a neutral uh, place and test it in, in front of uh, other shooters. Um, thank you, Alex, for agreeing to help us today. Um, and uh, I'll show you we have two uh, identical computers running both systems today. Uh, nothing is running aside from the, um, from the software. And um, the, the systems are mounted on the same gun. Um, also, um, the, the trace is mounted on the left side. With that system, it's important to show that, um, to, to indicate in the program that you are mounting it on the left, and we did so. So it's um, good to go. Let's start and calibrate. Um, okay, we start trace, and there's scat. So go ahead, whenever you're ready. Okay. <coughs> Okay, we'll uh, we'll adjust the the shot now. It's um, outside the seven ring at seven o'clock. So um, we'll adjust both systems now. The the trace is adjusted by pressing the control key and dragging the shot. Um, okay, just outside the seven ring. We're good here. Okay, and we can. Well, let's keep the scat like that. Um, it seems like it's actually fairly well adjusted. So let's let's keep going as is. Okay, we have the shot at 11 o'clock in the 7, almost an 8. And let's see what the systems show us. Oh, sorry about that. Um, so we have the same on the scat, and we have a close but not quite on the trace. Um, so, okay, let's go on. Okay, what do we have there? We have a 9.8 at 9 o'clock exactly, and um, pretty much the same in the scat. And we have, you leaving? Bye-bye. Bye-bye. So, <laughs> okay. Uh, so, and the last shot on the trace was a 7. Oh, and we have, okay, 7 at at 6.30 for an unknown reason. 
um, and the, the, you can actually see that the trace um, shows a similar trajectory. Um, I mean, not the same, but it's similar. You see by the by this entrance line, um, it's similar to here to the beginning, but the shot went completely into a different place. So go ahead. Okay, what do we have? We have a nice 10 at 6 o'clock. And the sketch shows us a very similar picture. We have a 10.3 at 6 o'clock. And we have an 8 on the trace. Um, what's important to note, though, that it's not really as much as about matching the shots even. It's about the line. And uh, what's most important about these systems is looking and analyzing this line because this is your movement. This is how you can notice the errors and mistakes. Um, and the main problem here is that um, you, you, you need to rely on this system to show you exactly what your movement was. If it doesn't show you exactly uh, the recording of your movement, um, th there will be no benefit of using it. Um, so, okay, let's, let's go on. We'll look into the details later. Okay, what we've got, we have a 9 at 8 o'clock, right? Yeah, it's 9 at 8 o'clock. And we have a, uh, oh, sorry. Sorry about that. The camera is acting up. Uh, and we have a 9 at like 9.30 on the scat. And we have an 8.8 .8 on the trace. It's right there. Right there is a shot from the trace. Um, so, okay, let's go on. I'll try to show you both screens at the same time. Okay. And the target systems is showing us a uh, like a 7:30 or 8, 8 o'clock, 8.8 .8 at 8 o'clock. And we have an 8.9 at 8 o'clock on the scat, and we have a 9 at almost 6 o'clock. It's, it's hard to see the shot here, but it's, it's actually right there. I'll, I'll try to show you. There. There is the last shot for the trace. Um, okay. And there it is for the scat. I'll, oh, that's the whole replay. It, it's hard to see it sometimes because of the lines, but it's right there. Okay. 
and it, it, it matches what we, we see there. Okay, we have a 6 o'clock 10 on the scat, uh, we have, this was actually the shot that was recorded in the trace, for some reason it recorded a second shot after that, that you, you see it right there, but it isn't the shot that Alex just shot, um, this is the shot um, that was last on the trace, um, well let's say 6.30 or 7 direction and uh, on the seven ring and the target system is sh the system is showing us a uh, yep a almost at 10 at the clock so you can see it here see it here and here okay go on Give it some time. Okay, what do we have on the target system? Uh, the target is showing us a 4 o'clock 9.9, .9, and the systems are showing us, um, well, the SCAT is showing us a, a 10 at 4 o'clock, and the trace is showing us an 8 at 4 o'clock. Um, however, once again, I, I really want to, like, I wish. You could see it clearly. I'll try to point it out later in the video. But um, what's important is, let me bring it a little closer, is how different the the lines are. So um, I can't blow it up here. So, oh, there it is. Okay, so um, if you look closer, um, you can see that the, the actual trace line I mean, it, it, it does give you a trajectory, the, the trace system does give you a trajectory, however, it looks completely different from what actually happened. So we, we see here what actually was the movement, and it, it looks similar, and, and yet not the same. And in, in the sport of accuracy, you need to have uh, pretty much accurate tools. Um, okay, but let's, let's go on. We have a nine ring at eight o'clock. 
we have exactly the same nine at eight o'clock here in the scat, and we have a um, seven point eight at seven o'clock on the trace. So, and oh, sorry about that. The camera is getting stuck all the time. So I'm going. So I think this is the ninth shot. Right, this was the ninth shot. We have one shot to go. No, it's, it's, it's all good, you can continue, but I'm not sure why, but the trace is not recording. Well, let's try it again. here. We have a 10 at 9 o'clock here. And uh, unfortunately for the last shot, Trace did not record anything, but let's, let's give it another chance. So although we did have 10 shots already, right? We have 10. Um, can we show all the shots on the screen, on the target? Yeah. the entire series. Okay, so these are the shots. Hope you can see them. And on the scat, you can see them in this corner here. This is the group of all your shots. Um, and this is what we see on the trace. Also, we have, we have one or two extra shots on the trace because um, here is a zero and here is another zero. Um, it, it, it seems like it accidentally recorded uh, one or two shots. Um, but this is all. Thank you very much. Thanks again, Alex. Thank you.